Well, I hope you're having a good safe Wednesday. We had round one of severe storms, some damage, some heavy rain earlier. Round two is expected this evening and round three overnight. We still have the uh, elevated and even enhanced risk for severe storms, a likelihood of severe storms this evening and overnight. And look at this, even more of a significant impact in Middle Tennessee. That gets close to the plateau. So all modes of severe weather are possible this evening with round two and overnight and early Thursday morning with round three. So that's what we're looking at. We have a flood watch that will continue to be in place now through 8 a.m. Heavy rainfall likely at times and certainly could produce some flooding. And tornado watch will be in place through 9 p.m. Central Daylight Time. We could have additional watches being issued later this evening. Here are the potential severe weather impacts. Certainly the highest impact still expected to be damaging winds. That next second round this evening between about 6 p.m. to midnight could contain damaging wind gusts. Power outages from down trees and power lines are possible. Heavy rain could lead to flooding. That's also a high impact. A low end moderate impact. A few tornadoes are possible and also a moderate impact. Uh, large hail, egg size or larger. All modes of severe weather are possible. Again, that arrival time from 6 p.m. to midnight on the plateau, 7 p.m. to 1 a.m. in the valley, and this next second round of severe storms from 8 p.m. to 2 a.m. for eastern areas. So our future cast will show that 6 p.m. on the plateau. Again, coming off the plateau closer to 8, 9 p.m. in the valley. There is 10 p.m. Again, severe weather, damaged winds, very heavy rainfall, a few tornadoes, large hail possible. There's that 10 to 11 p.m. Again, very heavy rainfall, but one two punch, severe weather on the front end, heavy rain and flooding on the back end. That threat continues. Here's round three between three and seven a.m. A final round of some heavier showers, maybe some strong to severe storms on the front end and more heavy rain that could lead to additional flooding as we go through our Thursday morning. We're going to be here throughout the night and throughout Thursday morning to keep you updated. So keep it right here for the very latest and have a good safe night.